Hey everybody, it's Jeff Bess, uh, race of the day for Friday at Saratoga, August 19th. And it's race five, seven furlongs on the dirt. Really interesting race because the two morning line favorites, the three and the five, are ranked at the bottom of the chart. And they both have energy scores of only 82, which is not super good in this field. Um, and the, the five in particular has a PFTS percentage of 0.5 which is not good. So, you know, it's a, it's a, this is kind of a race that, you know, definitely you want to play because you could toss both those horses with confidence, in my opinion. Now, four other horses get a C, which I mean, they have something positive going for it, but not anything super great. We'll talk about the horses, but the one horse, Nicholas James gets a K plus with the spot play. $11 of value based on these odds lines, which are very similar. 2.7 to 1 for PFTS odds and 3.1 to 1 for best odds compared to this morning line of 9 to 2. It's the lone front runner in the race. It's always a concern going seven furlongs. Front runners do struggle a little bit more uh, in that situation. But the horse does have very good early speed. And there's only a couple of horses, I think, that will go could go with it probably won't t3 that's not going to go with it t5 probably not either so the 97 should he should get the lead um energy of 87 is on top tied with this horse eminency who does get a one here for pfts percentage so this horse has been running at the distance of seven furlongs um, this horse at eight to one does actually get a dollar of value over here. I only highlight it in green if it gets at least two dollars. Um, but that horse actually has some positives for it, including the the energy rating. Uh, maybe I would use that horse second overall, two two three. Definitely going to key on this one. Hard to figure out who's going to take second. You got another horse here with some significant value. Inspiration point four. A closer definitely want to maybe use this horse underneath it has eight dollars of value here's another closer um good form cycle working for it deep closer here very no early speed but humongous leg kick that's might be a horse you could use underneath so there's a lot of things you could do vertically that may make this race a little chaotic when that happens and again i'm just sort of talking out loud uh, as I'm looking at this, when that happens, I usually want to stay away from the uh, the vertical exotics. Um, maybe something really small with the the four, two, or eight underneath this one, um, and just really key in on the one uh, horizontally and the one on top to win. All right, good luck to everybody.